Are you ready to bleak your faith forsakenly? Well, I sure hope so, cause that's what we're gonna be doing. Partially at least, but let me see if I can maybe get any upgrades. Requires Mark 1, uh, can I upgrade this thing? One splinter, alright, cool. And then that's gonna need Mark 4. But also apparently the Rat Again Saber now has an ability, the Wind Blade. Yo. Like, that's new, it's pretty cool, it's got a cooldown on it, it's not too long, and it gives you a projectile, that's nice. It goes pretty far, god damn! <laughs> Bro, it hit the wall, oh my, yo, what about damage, can this thing do some damage? 79, I mean, it, it definitely does some damage. Uh, wait a minute, 49 damage and additional 4 from agility attribute per instance of damage for a total of... I, that, that's a lot of numbers, man. But, alright, so this benefits from agility. Yo, what the fuck the hell is that man using? Looks like like a wood with thorns or some stuff yeah wanna give me that weapon M no but he did give me a medium restorative pack all right there's a giant over here and i never really enjoyed fighting these dudes but let's see if it's any different now right, let me get out of here all right you can probably iframe the red attacks maybe perhaps but i i know you can't perfect block the, the red attacks. Come on. That is a healthy ass leg. But eventually, I'ma get there. Alright, climbing enemies. Yes, yeah, still same thing. Alright, so can I just straight up kill him? Come on. Please. Please just fucking die. God, that hits. Alright. Yeah, like that, that grab or whatever they do when you're on their back, it's a little... I know, even the animations is kind of hard to see what they're doing, but they sometimes just do it. It's... I don't know, man. These guys are kind of awkward, not gonna lie. They're an interesting idea, but the execution... It, uh, it, it does just feel a little awkward. Hold up. Change to this one. It's almost done. Alright. But then I, I still have to the damage the other side like bro these guys are just a lot of work bro let's go come on please just fucking die all right that's gonna give me upgrade splinter great hammered a lesser anomalous crystal what about this citadel warrior all right cool yo there's another dude over here just begging to be Taken from behind, yo, Hunter, bro, all right, cool. Well, it's it's the same thing that I'm using, except it's got a hood. Oh, bro, another fucking giant. Nah, thanks, man. I'm good. Those fights are fucking tedious, man. Anyway, there's a little hole I can... Yeah, yeah, it's over here. Yo, if you want to drop those weapons for me right now, bro, I will switch to a fucking dex build so fast. <laughs> Just saying. Yep. Oh, nice. I right, did not get the counter hit. Yo, that Dark Souls 3 weapon art. Alright, upgrade splinter. No swords, though. But there are actually a lot of different enemies in this build of the game. And I do appreciate it. Like, all of these guys are new. But I remember you had a bunch of restless knights over here and stuff. And now they're just kind of gone. These alien ass looking motherfuckers, they aren't gone though. They they can jump over your attacks. They're super annoying. They're still here. Oh! The teleporty guys! They say there is no genius without a touch of madness. What about those where madness is in abundance? You know, weirdly enough, I really like the voice acting in this game. Like, every single NPC, it just sounds like it fits, you know? And, and they have those like weird accents and I don't mean weird accents in like a bad way I mean, I'm sure a lot of you think my accents weird. Where the fuck is that dude going? But it's nice, you know, it's not that Clean English. I mean it is clean, but it's got that 
you know, it's got a little extra and it's I, I like hearing it. Also, this tunnel that leads into the sewers is now filled with barnacles or something. It's the same stuff that shows up at the deluge. Oh, wait a minute. Wait, you don't need to crouch to get through the tunnel anymore. Huh. Well, that kinda sucks. Honestly, I think it would be cool if they actually use the crouch thing more often to get into certain places of the map, but they just removed it here. I think every time a game has any type of crouching, it's always nice when you can use it for exploration to get into tiny places and stuff. Also, this guy is still as wiggly as ever. Uh, that should give me a ring of the blessed hand. Yeah, that's pretty nice plus 10% attack power That is nice. Also, I have this ring of burning desire, which I actually don't remember where I got it But plus 20% chance to inflict hit status effect I want to check if I just have that on even though my weapon doesn't you know do any status effect by itself do I suddenly just unlock the ability to burn people because, oh wait I do god damn you motherfucker the burning doesn't do a whole lot of damage but I also remember that there is that debuff mastery that allows for burning effects to heal you so that's also nice Dual wielding with some debuff mastery could be promising. Also, this guy respawns? What the f I'm pretty sure this guy didn't use the respawn. Oh, these things also show up whenever you... Brooke, I'm not... Are you fucking ki- I'm nowhere near that thing! Fuck you, man! Bro, I, I fucking hate these illusions or whatever these things are. This guy has the evolved halberd or evolved scythe. It's an evolved scythe, I think. Hey, oh. Alright, dude, let me heal real quick. Alright, he does not stagger easily. Bro, yo. Alright, kill him. Nice. Loot. Zealot chest piece. Yo, we still got the ninja dude over here. Bruck. Prong, prong. Come on. Come on. Alright. Loot. Kamas. Let's go. Pretty cool weapon. Although I'm probably not gonna be using them. So this guy just moves around now. I mean, I, <laughs> I say moves around loosely. Actually, hold up. Can I just cheese this dude from over here? That was fucking disgusting, my guy. God damn. Anyway, yeah, I mean, you can somewhat cheese this guy through the wall. Also, whenever I hold the new menu, there is the... That's the homunculus, right? Yes, that's homunculus mirage. That's the scanner. And the other one, I think it's the Mobius blade. Respawn it. Oh, all right. So it, it, it sends you back. So basically you kill yourself. I well actually is there an animation for that? Yes. No, I you, you just you just die. All right. I mean that's cool. I thought he was going to like get on his knees and plunge that thing into his stomach or some shit. Also I completely forgot. But if I upgrade the kite shield, does it actually increase the 51 51 30 yes it does increase how much it can block but at the same time for a shield whose main purpose is blocking i mean do i want to upgrade it there's probably other shields out there with just straight up better stats like for example the military i mean maybe hold up let me check so I also have the flat shield. Yo, 61 on slash? Actually, no, that, that it's just better. And then when it comes to the flat shield, yeah, this thing is just better. Which kind of sucks, but considering the shields don't really have, like, abilities or anything, yeah, I mean, there's not a lot you can do to make them better. Besides making them better than the previous one. Although you could 
maybe like specialize the shields. Maybe one is like very good against Slash, another very good against Technomancy, you know, that type of stuff. No, wait, no, the, the shields do have abilities. Shield bash. It bashes with a shield kite shield that doesn't really have anything but i mean it's the it's your starter shield you know it's kind of whatever the flat shield though could use a little something maybe like a buff type ability that increases damage and defense or you know some golden vow type shit maybe something like that yo bro that twin blade is fucking dangerous man all right hit me again boom let's go he and he. All right, no, my loot. Fucking bitch. Yo, I got a handler echo over there. Also, I just realized something, and it's kind of a problem. I have my interact on X, and you know th these modifier actions right here, which are your skills down there i can't have an x like if i'm holding the modifier i can't use x for the shield bash and if i go to controller button mappings i can't have both the interact button and the fourth action being the interact button although it would require for you to also press the the modifier button what about combat attack draw heavy attack gamepad right trigger all right so if i put right trigger here what come on that, that i mean <laughs> what is the point of the modifier then what am I doing wrong here? I'm pretty sure this is a bug. I mean, I can't put anything here that I have anywhere else, like the D-pad. Now this one's missing, but like the point of the modifier is to give you like a whole extra set of buttons, but I, I can't put anything here on the fourth action. I'm not even gonna try to touch these. Because I don't want to break it, but I, I can't change my fourth action without replacing something else on the other buttons. So right now I am simply unable to use my shield bash ability. Damn, are these stairs tighter or what? God damn. Alright, the deluge, pretty nice picture. So is the, the rain district, looks absolutely sick. Rain district, so that's, it's nice block also pretty cool oh shit she's just sitting on the ledge over here yo that's nice that's actually kind of cool manufacture anyway can i do something uh that's mark two that i could upgrade this actually yes let's go the armor though i am currently rocking all medium i'm probably gonna switch to heavy but right now like i don't have a lot of maximum encumbrance yo that's plus 7.5 base weapon damage that's kind of nice actually never mind citadel warrior 2 plus 7.5 i mean that's kind of hot what about the head yo ranger with that double plus 7.5 give me that i i think this looks pretty cool the fashion game right now pretty nice we got these dudes over here how's the damage looking not insane but it's fine also by the way can i perfect block this thing bro you throw it back yo that's that's kind of weird but that's pretty sick this perfect block stuff overall i mean pretty nice addition to the game i'm pretty sure a lot of people are gonna be happy with it <laughs> that's kind of nice that you can do that yo that guy's gonna die from the burning. Yep. Alright, so, we got a cape over there. Actually, we have three capes. Intelligence and critical damage. Um, flux point, blah blah, I don't need that. Three strength. Although I gotta say that the sentinel overcoat, which is like, you know, a coat. It, it, it looks pretty cool. Like, the idea has a cloak. To just give your character a coat, it's pretty nice. I, I kind of wish they made more of these. I could definitely imagine like some Dante style red leather coat or something like that. I think it would overall fit with the theme of this game. 
Wait, what? The, where did I just fucking lock on into? Holy... What? Also, I got some experience from over... What the fuck just that? Yo, what? who the hell is that guy? Is this a new dude? Uh, kind of, I, the model is new, but I think I recognize the animations. It's from that dual wielder in the desert, I think. Yeah, but yo, this dude has some fucking health on him. The model looks pretty sick, but I don't think I'm gonna be killing this guy. Imagine if you could maybe make them fall into the water and then the snakes would kill them. <laughs> Am I asking too much? <laughs> I mean, that would be sick though. Bruh, who needs ranged weapons? Bows what? The fuck even is that? I wish it did just a little bit more damage so we could get this over with a little faster. But, I mean, I ain't gonna complain. What? Also, something I really like about this game's combat is that you can actually just outspace enemy attacks and that is very nice. That it, it's something that I feel like it's a little underrated in Souls-likes But just being able to outspace stuff like that feels very Dark Souls 1 In a good way Bro, how many of these guys are in here? And they're all gonna start throwing fucking projectiles at- Bruh! Just god damn! Where's the- Alright, I, I can't- I can't do it like this, hold up Can he reach me from here? Do the fucking arm on this man! Come on! Bro, all right, let's go, let's go, bro, and now run in, charge heavy. I for a moment I I kind of forgot we had running attacks now. Also, this used to be a weapon like the the paladin mace. Yes. Now this is actually where we want to go. It's over there. But that's also gonna make the game harder, so I'm gonna wait on that. Also, are these stairs supposed to be separate from the- <laughs> that, that looks a little weird. There's a crevasse in there. Anyway, let me just jump into the water. See if I can actually, like, uh, how do I da swim down? It says right trigger there. Hello? I'm on a controller. Please, how do I- Swim down. Button mapping, swimming, ascend and descend. There are, there are no buttons for ascending and descending. Is square doing anything else? It was the switch weapon, but it didn't actually replace the input. So that's nice. Uh, but actually, I think I might prefer the square here and descend maybe the circle button. Also, I am unable to attack in the water, so no, they didn't add water combat. It's just, yeah, it's when you get grabbed, you can use R1 to attack. But also, if my memory serves me right, this should be a shield. Yes, the hoplite shield. Is it better than the military shield? Not quite. Plus, they have the same ability. Alright, so this is the pathway into the asylum. I think the asylum is supposed to be, you know, relatively early game. I think. Not too sure. Shortcut unlocked. Very nice. God damn, these fucking spiders got some health. I mean, sure, I'm just using like a pussy ass one handed weapon. But fuck, man. <laughs> what is that? Holy shit. I'm out of stamina. Great. Alright. Just walk around them. Keep hitting them. It's not that bad. Just kind of tedious. Ring of life steel. Alright. That, that's probably useful. Also, there's that crazy ass helmet over here. Yep, the ellipse helmet. These things look pretty creepy, but as long as you stay underneath them... Like, they, they can't really do much to you, honestly. Also, by the way, correct me if I'm wrong, but... Every time I throw an R2 after a perfect block, I think I'm getting a crit, right? Yeah, it, it has been pretty consistent, and that is cool. I mean, because... Oh, that, that's not... What the... What? 
Bro, I got fucking flesh banged. And then this man died because of the fire. Also, I'm gonna upgrade the Paladin Maze. Ability Divine Blessing. Except I can't actually use it. Alright, so that might mean that I'm gonna have to put some points into intelligence. Or, alternatively, I can just find a different weapon that I can actually use. You know, that would also be nice. Yo, can I fuck and... Yeah, nah, th these guaranteed crits are kinda nice. So, open up the shortcut. Very nice. Is this door different? I feel like this door looks different. But anyway, I think there used to be a handler echo back there. Or it was at least one of the possible spots for handler echoes. But getting through this bitch, it just... I, I, I don't even... What the fuck? You know, just... Uh, I... How? How? I am fucking dying over here! Can you do anything to this? No, you can't hit him. Can I maybe... No... Then I wasn't expecting it to either. Like, how the fuck? Well, I... Look, I don't know, I'm on the other side. There's the echo. These things fucking suck. Let's go. Bro. And tongue. And bro. <laughs> bro. That's pretty cool. I like it. Bro, I don't know what the hell you're doing, but you're gonna have to fucking stop. Alright, give me all of these. Upgrade splinter. Pluck, bang, and also there is an axe in this room the crescent axe also wasn't there uh oh it's there it's it's this thing that's another one of those crazy helmets the skull face helmet now we can open up the shortcut and there's also another armor set here which vengeance legs cuirass helmet i think the last time i played I don't think that armor set was complete. I think he was missing some pieces, but now I think it's a, it's actually a full armor set. I like the, the little armor, the plating on the legs. Pretty nice. And gauntlets. Yeah, I mean, the, the set does look pretty cool. But currently doesn't really have any of the stats I'm looking for, so I'm gonna have to go back to what I was using because we're gonna be fighting a boss and honestly I should be probably using uh, you know some gear that's slightly more upgraded but it's fine let's just let's just see how it goes damage is all right it's it's not it's not terrible if I pay attention to what I'm doing I'm sure I can make it Although we only have two healing flasks, like it's, it's a little, yo, Ugh. all right, come on, let's go, let's lock in, lock in, let's go. Oh, wait a minute, her weapons are different, it's a different model, they look fucking sick, what is that, oh shit, it's this thing, fuck, run, all right, all right, all right. We, we good, we good, we good, all right, now, get, get, get out of there, good, iframes. Come on. Uh, what is that? I don't know. That's it's the, the double slash. That's fine. Get back. Uh, is that? Yeah. yeah all right. So, fuck, man. Don't, dude, get these things out of here, bro. All right. We good. Zung, pluck, fuck, but not really. Come on. And truck, truck, truck. Get out of there. Uh, yeah, run, 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 run. Alright, good. Truck, truck. Shit, I was too close. And... We're in the last... Th well, are we? Well, we are now. We are on the last third of its health. Where, where are the little balls? Alright, I must stay around here. Come on. Cool stuff. What else? Bro, the music on this boss fight goes so fucking hard. And I have looked everywhere on YouTube for it, but I just can't find it. But it is like the best OST in this fucking game. It's got them plagued nemesis, bro. 
This it's crazy. It looks like a fucking Tekken soundtrack or some shit. Maybe like a, maybe like Tekken 5 or something. I don't know, man. It's but it is sick. Yeah. And prak, prak, prang. Right, she's gonna do the little. Th no, wait, what? No, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's this. It's this. Uh, I think those little jump pads or whatever they like teleport to upwards. I think that's what they do. I don't remember too well, but I think they they just send you up in the air, then you're gonna fall and take damage. What is that shit? Shit! All right. Let's just eat one of these for precaution. Go around. Prak, pong, pong. Come on, just get greedy now. All right, maybe don't. Also, can I bury maybe one of her attacks? Well, probably not this one. Uh, let's go over here. Sure. Come on. I, I wanna. I wanna try and parry a boss. That was stupid on my part. Uh, come on. Some of her animations are just kind of weird. Like, it's better to just stay away from her. But I just wanna try to parry something. Oh, let's go! Oh! All right, unstable perk essence. We got the Kopeshes. Actually, I, I want to check out the model on those Kopeshes. Bro, look at that crazy ass shit. I that that's different, right? The Kopeshes did not look like that, man. They did not. I again, I don't remember what they looked like, but they didn't look like that. <laughs> that's for sure.